Uh, this is for documenting my progress. This is not a tutorial. So uh, my goal here is when a player collides with the enemy, the player will be disabled and then goes back to its original position that started at the beginning of the game and then gets enabled, enabled again. So I created on trigger enter 2D. Uh, the player has the box collider 2D and a rigid body 2D. And then when it collides with the enemy, I will check if the uh, photon view is myself. Then I will call a RPC function called hit by enemy. I will use RPC target all because I want all the players to see this happening. Um, this player, this uh, variable over here is just a photon real time dot player, which I defined earlier. Uh, and then this hit by enemy function must have this pun RPC attribute. It calls this core routine called hit by enemy routine. Here it will disable the player, waits for a little bit, resets to his original position, waits for a little bit, and then gets enabled again. So if we try to do a little test here. So this one is the editor. And then I have a mobile connecting soon. So room name, just hi, I'll create. And now that's the editor and now I'll join the mobile. And then I will press play. So I'm gonna move this one here. Now the one that's actually moving is the mobile. So the enemies currently are not synced. So the enemies on the editor and the mobile are not in the same spot. So what I can do is try to collide the enemy with the player on the mobile and see if they, they will sync. Oops. That ain't good. There we go. Hi. Right. So I'm gonna try to sync it up. I'm gonna try to get the mobile one. So you see, it got collided and gets re-enabled. There you go. Uh, 